Hey guys, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last video, um, we beat the, the final boss in Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. After that, we went to the, the sorry, we went to the Hyrule Market, and then so we can head to Hyrule Castle to meet up with Zelda and give her the spiritual stones. But we encountered Ganondorf, and then he just, well, kind of owned us and just went after Zelda, so yeah. And after that, we, oh, fuck, I'm sorry, I guess I can't talk today. Um, after that, we dove into the, oh, fuck, oh my god, wow, I suck right now, I am sorry. But, um, we got the Ocarina of Time that Zelda threw in the water, and then we head into the Temple of Time, pull out the Master Sword, we met the Sage, Raru, and then after that, we're back in the real world, and then we met up with Sheik. Sheik told us about the, um, the other sages that needs to be awakened, and what we need to do is get um, the next item to proceed on before we head to the Forest Temple, which is... Um, I, yeah, I'm sorry, but yeah, we just need to get the next item before we head to the Forest Temple. That's um, what we need to do. Alright, so without further delay, let's go. All right, here we are, Temple of Time. Our first, yeah, our first destination is Kakariko Village, and holy crap, Death Mountain! What the hell is up with you? Well, here we go. Let's go see what happens in seven years. Holy fuck! Look at you guys. It's the Redeads. Yeah, that screen you hear. You won't be paralyzed when you're in the town market right here. So this is the only area where. Um, like, you don't be paralyzed from those guys. Alright, anywho, let's go! <sighs> I apologize for not uploading this as much as, as soon as possible, you know. Uh, of course, laziness, whatever, procrastinating, all that crap, you know. I'm kind of doing a little bit of animating here and there, but also still lazy. Yeah, yeah, I know. Same excuse, blah, blah, blah. It's not always gonna be an excuse. I know that. And I'm sorry. Seriously, I need to continue with this. Now, anyways, here we are in Kakariko Village. Everything looks kind of gloomy because the, the sky is just very cloudy. Alright, um, let's see. What do we need to do if I can remember? Uh, we need to go to this way first. I think. No, wait, actually. Actually, here we can get. Um, we can learn another song melody. Let's talk to this guy. He's pissed as fuck. Look at his eyes. Zombie like shit. Anyways, I'll never forget what happened on that day seven years ago. Grrr. Uh huh. It's all that Ocarina kid's fault. Next time he comes around here, I'm gonna mess him up. Pull out your Ocarina. What? You got an ocarina? What the heck? That reminds me of that time seven years ago. Back, back then, a mean kid came here and played a strange song. It messed up this windmill. I'll never forget the song. And here's the next melody that we needed to learn. And there we go. We just learned the song of storms. We're gonna need this for this part of the game. Yeah. Okay. Got the song of storms. And see that mel I mean, bleh, the windmill is going a bit faster now. Oh no, a storm again! You played the ocarina again, didn't you? Grr. Okay, sir. Hey, look, a heart piece up there. Uh, we'll get that pretty soon. Let me just give me a second. Alright, now we gotta go through here, back to the graveyard. Okay, let's see if I can remember. Which grave was it? Mm, I think it was this one right here where this green, the grass right here is um, spreading. Alright, grab this. Pull, pull a tombstone. Lag. And here we go. Damn it. Really? Again? 
The fuck, Link? No, this is not the one. Damn it. Uh. Okay, maybe it's that one. Hey, look, there's a ghost. Fuck you. I don't need you. Alright. Ah, you missed, bitch. Nope. Go down here. Yeah, this is the one. Hey, look! It's that guy from earlier in the game. <laughs> Young man! Are you fast on your feet? I may not look like it, but I'm confident in my speed. Let's have a race. Follow me if you dare. Alright. So, we pretty much gotta follow this guy. Can't lose sight of him. And careful not to get hit by those things. Get hit by that fire? It won't. See? Just like that. What did I tell you? You bitch. I honestly don't know what happens if you don't follow him correctly. Or maybe I do know it's just that I just don't remember. Whatever, I don't know, fuck it. <laughs> but yeah, we just gotta catch up to this guy. Now nah, you're not hitting me with that again. And I heard redads along the way, so... You gotta be fast to catch up with this guy. Ah, fuck! Not again. Nope. Okay, he went up there. Come on. Ah, I'm not gonna get hit by that again. Nope. Okay, we gotta be fast. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, we caught up with him. Now let's speak to him. The time of this race was one minute and eight seconds. <laughs> Young man, you are very quick to be able to keep up with me. <laughs> As a reward, I'm going to give you my treasure. It's called a hook shot. Its spring loaded chain will pull you to any spot where its hook sticks. Doesn't that sound cool? I'm sure it will help you. I live here now, so come back again sometime. I'll give you something cool. One more thing. Be careful on your way back. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you, Navi. And here we go. Navi, shut up. And we got our prize. The hook shot. It's spring-loaded chain that you can cast out to hook things. Yeah, this is pretty much what we need to... Um... To, uh, enter in the forest temple. Alright, whoops, didn't mean to, but whatever. Oh, look at these right here. Damn it, Navi. Damn it, Navi. Navi! Navi. Anyways, well, when you see these crates right here, you take out your ocarina and you play the song of time. Nah, nah, I'm good. I don't feel like talking to you right now. And here we are, we're back in the windmill. Alright, I'm gonna get that heart container, but I just need to wait for this thing right here to just to. Ah, oh, damn it, Navi. I wonder what's going on in the Force Temple right now. I'm worried about Saurian, too. I know, Navi. Okay, just gotta jump on that right. Ugh, okay, I thought I was gonna fail. Then I will have to go all the way back and retry that. Now you've collected three pieces. Oh, okay, cool, you know. Let's get out of here. Okay, now, next thing, what we want to do. Um, let's see. Um, you know what? I could just head to the forest temple like right now, but before I do that, I want to do this little side quest first. And that quest is getting the big Goron sword. Sword that doesn't ever break. Because if you just go buy the big Goron sword, or in this case the giant's knife from uh, Goron City, the more you use it, like I guess enemies are hitting against walls or whatever. It's gonna break eventually, but with the big Goron sword, 
it'll never break, no matter how many times you keep swinging around. So yeah, we're gonna do the big go on uh, the, fuck, the big go on's quest. First things first, I'm gonna go right here in Long Long Ranch, so we can get our valiant steed. And it's getting dark. Whatever. I hear the phone ringing. I'm not gonna pause it and go to go and get it. I don't feel like doing that. I don't know if the guy right there is there or not, but let me just do this real quick. Shouldn't take me long. Okay. Alright, come on. Long on ranch. Alright, here we are. Daytime. Yes. Da -da -da. And here we go. Look, our horse. It's over there. Epona. And this guy. Hmm, there are some people in Kakariko spreading rumors that I cheated Talon out of the ranch, but don't be ridiculous. That guy Talon was weak. I, the hardworking Ingo, poured so much energy into this place. I don't want any strangers like you saying anything bad about me. Listen, the great Ganondorf recognized my obvious talents and gave the ranch to me. I will raise a fine horse and win recognition from the great Ganondorf. Say, young man, do you want to ride one of my fine horses? Pay me 10 rupees and you can ride. Sure. Do you want to hear how to learn ride? Nah. Thank you. Yeah, whatever. Let's just go. Now, let's call our horse. Alright. There you go. Hey there. Alright. So, we just get on Epona, hit the A button. And we go faster, and of course you see how the, it takes up a carrot. Keep hitting it all the way, well, you're still gonna go fast. But don't overdo it, okay? Alright, there. You know, just do a little, like, moving around, you know, and whatnot. Just so you can get used to this, you know? It's pretty fun. Okay. Alright. Let's go talk to this guy. Whoa, lag. Right, let's talk to him. When you want to dismount, stop and press. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna read all of that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. Are you ready to go home so soon? No, I want to ride. Tis, tis. When you're done, I'll kick you out of here. Yeah, yeah. When you want to dismount a horse. Uh, no. I thought I was supposed to talk to this guy first. Dude. Let me talk to this guy. Yeah, fine, fine, I'm done. Whatever. Faggot. Alright, speak to him again. Yeah. Pam, don't listen, whatever. Let me call Epona again. Come on, Epona. Need you right now. Hop aboard! Oh yeah, as you already noticed, when you jump over these fences over here in Long Long Ranch, you get rupees. So, I guess you're getting your money back. Alright, you know, that's enough. Talk to him. You're getting better. How about a little race with me? One lap around the corral with that horse. Let's make a little wager. Say 50 rupees? Ah, fail. 50 rupees? Yeah. Alright, here's what we need to do. We need to beat this guy about twice. Come on. Of course, you gotta go faster. Which is obvious. You gotta get in first place. Be conservative on your carrots, though. 
and then you'll start to slow down. Nah, stay behind me, bitch. Nah, I'm winning this race. You can eat a dick. And there we go. The first round goes to me. Look at him. He mad. <laughs> Sh shoot! If the great Ganondorf found out about this humiliation, hey, you, how about another race? If you win, you can keep the horse. All right. Okay. This part is really not so tough, but it kind of can be a bit of annoying. Like, he's kind of faster. He'll be more of a dick to you. Like, he won't let you pass. Be conservative with the carrots. And when you have him, like, like, spread out a little more, um, that's your chance to just boost it. And there you go. See? It's actually easy, but still, it kind of, it can be annoying. There we go. I win this one. What's up with that horse? Is that Epona? How did you tame that wild horse right under my nose? I was going to present that horse to the great Ganondorf, but I bet it on the race and lost. Shoot! <laughs> As I promised, I'll give you the horse. However, I'll never let you leave this ranch. You're a bastard. Sore loser much? You know, see, right here? You're thinking like, oh, I'm trapped, you know? Oh, no, God, I'm, I'm stuck here. But now nah, you can actually just jump out of here, like jump out through there or over there, you know, with enough speed and all that stuff. It's not that difficult. I was very confused at the very first time, but then I figured it out. Watch. Now, nah, fuck you, bitch. And here we are. We got ourselves our valiant steed, Epona. Now we can call Epona wherever we want to here in Hyrule Field. And also travel around here a lot faster. And obviously we can only use Epona here when you're adult Link, not young Link. Okay, for the quest for the big Goron sword. Epona, what do I need? I mean... Yeah, what do I need to do? I kind of forgot. I know we need to do several things here and there. Um, let me see. Come on, think, think, think. What do I need to go and do first? Hold up, thinking. Um, is I supposed to go to? In, um, you know what? Before we get started with the, you know, we'll get started with the um, get the blah, 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 blah. wow, good job, me. Anyways, before we get started with the big go on sword uh, quest, you know, I'll just show you real quick on what's up, you know. Alright, let me change it back today. Oh my god, friggin' laptop making that annoying noise where it's like or heating or whatever. Even with the cooling fan. That's why you guys don't hear the fan noise on my end. Uh I just hope this doesn't turn off on me when when I'm recording. Come on, let's go. Let's make it. I got time. Are right, we entering here? To Holy crap, not nah, bitch, you're not hitting me. The hell happened to Kokari Forest? Oh, wait, that's right. Seven years has passed. And if you look around, there's monsters everywhere. Come on. <laughs> Gotta get up here. Let's go. Now, nah, fuck you. Alright, let's go here. This song is catchy. Come on. Oh yeah, that's right. We gotta get past this guy. 
this little faggot. What are you? Though you work with Kyrish clothing, you can't fool me. I promise, sorry, I will never let anybody go through here. Yeah, okay, sure. Just play sorry a song. And then that will allow you to pass through. <clears throat> that melody. Saria plays that song all the time. You. Do you know Saria? That song. Saria taught that song only to her friends. Okay, I trust you. When I see you, I don't know why, but I remember him. Oh, me? I'm right here. Bitch ass. When I see you, I don't know why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good to know, bro. Alright, let's keep going. Wow. Sudden lag real quick. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, okay, that lag right there. That lag right there. Nah, you know what? Forget it. <laughs> I'm gonna stop it right here before I continue on. This lag right here is stupid. You know what? I wanna thank you guys for watching. I'll continue on in the next part. If you like what you see, give it a like. Comment if you wanna leave a comment. Subscribe for more if you're new to here. And I'll provide more in uh, videos in the next future, alright? I'm HyperShadix01. I'll see you guys later. Peace!